Clark. I'm here to talk about AMD FirePro Professional Graphics. I'm a senior application engineer at AMD. So FirePro Professional Graphics are basically an entire portfolio of graphics cards designed, built, tested, and certified to run business critical 3D applications. Um, 3D applications that require uh, longevity and require the performance that um, users need out there to be able to do their job and design workflows in the fastest way possible. The FirePro Professional Graphics portfolio actually spans quite a, a wide array of products. We have products that cover, of course, workstation graphics, as well as server graphics, so we have a couple of cards that are, are passively cool, designed for server chassis, as well as um, applications for things like BDI, virtual desktop infrastructure, as well as um, medical um, imaging, and um, as well as uh, 2D applications for multi-view. One of the key features of FirePro professional, professional Graphics is that we offer Ifinity. So Ifinity actually is the ability to run multiple displays, more than two displays, up to six displays off of one graphics card, which enables you to basically run a setup such as this on your desktop where you can take advantage of more uh, screen real estate in order to help improve your productivity in terms of your daily workflow. So what we're running here is actually three displays. These are 24 inch monitors running at, at 19, 20 by 1200 resolution off of a single V7900 graphics cards that we talked about earlier. Um, this is, might be a typical setup if you want to take advantage of more screen real estate to um, accelerate your workflow. Um, here um, we're showing some PTC products. So we have some wind chill running with Pro Engineer and or Creo. Creo is a new um, product coming from, Pro, uh, from PTC. We also have some pretty incredible technologies that are helping to accelerate graphics performance. We can see the side-by-side -side comparison running in Creo 2. So you can kind of see the difference in performance there in terms of the fluidity um, offered by our, our latest technologies. The idea behind the Ifinity is that you can basically take advantage of the, the additional uh, screen real estate um, to accelerate your workflow. So we have, you might have, you know, email, you might have Excel, you might have the various different applications that you use on a day-to-day -day basis and you can basically um, spread those out. And we also have a technology called Hydrovision that allows you to pre-configure different areas across the iFinity display so that you can manage your applications in a very efficient manner. So I'll just highlight a couple of the cards that we have. The latest generation of cards we call Northern Island cards or the 9000 series cards. I'll start off with this card. This is the V7900. This has two gigabyte RAM runs at 160 gigabyte per second memory bandwidth. It has basically four display port outputs, so you can run four displays simultaneously off this uh, individual card right here. Actually, we are running a B7900 right here on this uh, configuration right here. This is an actively cooled card. It's extremely efficient, and it's a single slot solution. So you can basically, if you have the need, you can load uh, more than one of these uh, cards in your chassis to achieve a very highly dense solution for uh, multiple monitor setups. We also have a new, just released this year, is the V4900. This is a half length, full height card. It has two display port outputs and a, a dual link DVI output. Um, this card is considered a, a entry level to mid range card. It has one gigabyte RAM and um, offers um, all the same technologies um, available in our Northern Island series of graphics cards. So also new for 2012, just released this month in February, is the V3900. This is a entry level card. It has 25 gigabyte per second memory bandwidth as well as one gigabyte uh, memory. And on the back, the connectors are one display port output and one dual link DVI output. This card is considered an entry level card, but it does offer all the same technologies as the rest of the Northern Island portfolio graphics cards.